hello guys welcome back to my channel and today we are going to make a simple space shooter game and let's just go in okay so if you don't know what the space shooter game is it's just like a rocket okay and in the space he has to shoot the rocks coming towards him and that's just it okay so let's go so first things first, delete the scratch cut and we'll click on choose a sprite and I will go to the fantasy section oh no, um, maybe I'll have to search it in all search rocket ok and you have this rocket ship okay that's nice you have this animation that we can use okay so we'll delete the costume 5 and we have a nice cool animation so let's test that animation with our own green flag clicked forever we'll next costume I will wait 0 0.1 second Yeah, that's nice maybe 0 0.05 seconds that's too fast I'll take the 0 0.1 okay so that's nice so now what we are going to do is in here click on this direction and pull and you can drag this direction and set it to 180 you can just type it in like 180 okay now we have that facing and we'll adjust the size so we'll set the size to 60 50 okay and I'll put it right here we'll add a backdrop you'll click on choose a backdrop I'll click on the space tab and I'll put in the stars. Okay, that's nice. And I'll choose another sprite. Call this rocks. Okay, so we have the rocks. I have these. And by the way, I will delete this rock here. I'll press delete. We click it. We click on it first okay and we'll delete okay so that's simple and we'll set the size to 50 maybe 60 slightly bigger okay nice so now the, we'll make the up and down um, code so when green flag clicked forever if key up arrow pressed we will change y by 8 put another if key down arrow pressed it will change y by negative 8 says that Add the animation and okay nice it's better so now we'll make the rocks go from here to the edge so I'll go to the rocks put in one green flag clicked we'll go to X actually my plan is to hide the rock the original sprite of the rocks I will hide it because I will make um, clones if you don't know clones just follow me forever we will wait one second 
I'll create clone of myself. Okay. Let's test that. Oh yes, and I've got to put in when I start as a clone. We will show. We will go to random position. We will set X to two hundred forty. Okay. I can see it goes in the random position. Okay. Nice. Now that's done. Now we'll make it move from here to here. Okay, so I'll put in repeat until repeat until put this X position is less than negative 240 x negative 250 okay we will go to random position we'll set x to 240 um wait leave it here and I'll put in a change x by 5 by negative 5 that's nice so we can have a moving cluster okay so repeat and and we'll put this go to x run number share set x oh actually I'll delete it so at the end we'll put in delete this clone it's simple okay so that's nice and now we want to make a bullet shooting with a rocket ship okay so we'll paint a new sprite and we'll make a red maybe white and we'll put in an outline I'll not put it in okay and you'll just make a nice square and put it right in here just right in here okay just follow me maybe right in here where just above that center you can see that yeah the center is there and just put the bullet right there okay you'll name this bullet okay so when green flag click you'll hide and forever if key space pressed we will create clone of myself we'll wait one second okay and then when I start as clone we'll show it put in a repeat until we'll put in an or condition repeat until touching rocks or touching edge okay maybe I'll put in a more than exposition is more than 240 maybe I'll put in 230 okay we will change X by 15 and we'll put in a delete this clone right here 
and in the when I start to clone I'll put in a go to rocket ship okay so that's nice and let's try it okay so we have it have a nice shooting bullet okay so the problem now is you can see the rocket ship and the bullet yes and the bullet just shoots um, outside of the rocket like this um, we want to put the bullet right behind the rocket ship okay so that's simple in the rocket ship you'll put in a go to front layer at the very beginning let's try that and it works okay nice okay so now what we're going to do is make the rocks die when it touches the um, the bullet so if touching bullet we will delete this clone okay so let's test that okay so that's nice and I will make another one we'll put in an and in a repeat until and we'll add in a touching bullet okay test that oh it still doesn't work um, I'll put in an if touching rocks we'll delete this clone okay, so let's just start okay so sometimes it doesn't work but sometimes it works maybe I'll put that away Okay, that still doesn't work. Oh. Put in touching bullet. And. Okay. And in the bullet. Okay, so that's. Um. Touching rocks. I think that's okay. Um, so what I'm going to do is, if touching bullet, we'll delete this clone. I'll delete this and. Okay, and in the in here, I'll put in that. Okay. Oh. Uh, okay, so that's nice. So that, and that's nice. Okay, so we have a shooting rocket. So now we'll make the game over if touching the rocket ship pretty simple the rocket ship I'll put in another if touching if touching rocks we'll broadcast message game over in the stage oh Actually, I'll paint a new sprite. You'll type in with the sans serif. Okay, I'll put in game over. I think I should put in pixel. Okay, and uh, I'll drag this to make it bigger. Game over. Okay. You'll change this to game 
over and you'll set the X and Y to zero. Okay, so when green flag clicked, we'll hide and when I receive game over we'll show and we'll stop all. Says that when it touches the rocks, game over. And in the rocket ship, I'll put in when I receive game over, we'll hide. In the rocks, it's okay, but it's okay. Okay, that's nice. So now we'll add scores. We'll make a new variable named score full sprites. Okay, so in the rock sprite, we'll set score to zero and we'll put in if in the if touching bullet we'll change score by one and I think I will add sound the sound I will choose a sound um pick another one uh, maybe I'll pick the pop okay that's nice okay so if touching bullet you'll play sound pop until done okay so let's test that okay you can't hear it, okay, so that's nice. So that is nice. And in the game over, you'll make a new sound. Maybe. Okay, so we'll pick this alert sound. Okay, and show it, and we'll play sound alert until done. Okay, so that's nice. Okay, so now we'll put in one green flag clicked. Oh, and I didn't. So in here, in the one green flag clicked, we'll put in a show. Okay. Let's test that. Okay, you can hear it. And yes. Okay, and in the rocks. When I receive game over, we will stop our description sprite. And the same thing for the when I receive game over, we'll stop other scripts in sprites okay so let's test that oh and I didn't show the variable score okay let's test that oh okay so thank you for watching this is a very good tutorial for beginners okay so thank you for watching Please leave a like, comment, share and subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Bye. Oh. Actually, before you leave, I will put in... Yeah, that's actually nice. Okay. Bye.